Hello viewers, welcome to Programming Geek. I am here with a new tutorial that is get data from SQL Server database to text box drop down list and the ready button control in ASP.NET C Sharp. previous tutorial I have shown complete good operation in ASP.NET C Sharp with SQL I mean insert update delete and charts let's check the data connection username essay password is SQL Server authentication password okay access the table folder uh, table name is instrument info underscore tab and the column now open table definition here i'm gonna insert one more column to show how to use the how to use the ready button list in sp.net okay sex column added update yes preferring update script update database click on update database yes database is updated now let's check the records here is only one record sex is mail let's just vote okay now go to default .sfx. here also Mm, add a ready button control to insert uh, sex uh, in a student info tab sex is uh, from ready button list just drag ready button list uh, from toolbox and drop it in asp.net form now inserting one more row yes add ready button list item edit uh, sex is male and female so I just added two item male and female let's click on ok this is default vertical so change the repeat direction to horizontal repeat direction horizontal in the property okay resize this ready button list and then uh, go to the insert button click event to insert the records uh, in the sex column as well so um, here's only address age and contact textbooks for now I'm gonna insert uh, sex from ready button list in that case and just copy and paste yes now change the control name control name is ready button list one dot ready button list one so for ready button list one dot selected value okay it's done now right click and view in browser to insert uh, two more records this is a uh, uh, already have one record now second record is 102 Christina Addis Canada age 23 and contact this is sex is female just click on insert yes inserted successfully with the uh, sex female from ready button list uh, okay now 103 name is Katie male insert yes the records is inserted successfully to get this tutorial go to the link given in the description box below this is that was a complete crude operation okay this button control i will use to get records from sql server database to control text box uh, drop down list and ready button list okay go to the button click event yes this is the get button click event just copy the sql command and paste it in get button click event because command is a bit same select a star from a student in founder score tab or student id equal to uh, student id from type x1 this is integer type okay now sql data reader srd equal to com com is, com is my sql command com dot execute reader okay and this is the connection string con the record uh, get record the record displaying the text box drop down list and ready button list uh, based on product id what product id you insert what product id you put in text box one product id call okay while srd dot read now text box 2 text box 2 dot text text box 2 for name so text box 2 dot text equal to srd dot get value name is the second index i mean index 1 uh, because sql server in the c sharp index start from 0 so let's check the 
Ask your third address table, 0 is student, third is student name, 1, address 2, as 3, and contact 4. Finally, sex is 5 index. So, name is index 1. Drop down list 1 dot selected value. This is for address. Address is index 2. So, SRD dot get value 2 dot twisting. And then, tax box 3 for age. Age is index 3. And then text box 4 contact contact is index 4 and then ready button list for sex sex is index 5 okay SRD dot get value 5 dot twisting okay save and reload this page yes now for the student ID 102 just click on get Oh, execute reader require an open and available connection to connection current status closed so uh, open the connection fast just put con dot open con is my sql connection what i already shown you con dot open and then after executing the operation just close the connection con dot close okay now reload this page again resend yes Okay, the uh, it's uh, signed successfully. One zero two, Christina Canada, uh, and age, sex, all are displaying perfectly. One zero one. If you have four one zero one, it's displaying the records based on product ID one zero one. If one zero two, then it's uh, displaying one zero two details. Student ID, student name, address, age, contact, and sex. If one zero three, yes, that student name, KD Canada, and sex. Okay, thanks for watching this tutorial.